I'm just delighted to announce today that we're funding three new projects to support upskilling and reskilling of people in work. Skills to Advance supports those working in vulnerable sectors within the workforce and those who need more opportunities to advance in their working lives and their careers. Congratulations, firstly, to Dublin and Leary ETB. You've been successful in your bid for a virtual reality and healthcare project, working closely with Galway Roscommon ETB, Our Ladies Hospice and Care Services, and Galway Hospice. This project will produce innovative and accessible learning resources to support non medical staff in the sector to upskill. Employers in the care sector will be supported to develop and mentor their staff to improve retention and to help close skills gaps by investing within their staff. Employees in this sector will be helped to progress their careers while gaining vital skills to ensure world-class standards of care for patients. Kildare Wicklow ETB have received funding for their Transforming Customer Service in the Experience Economy project, working in conjunction with Mayo Sligo Leitrim ETB, with IBEC, with Customer Service Excellence Ireland and Retail Ireland, among other partners. The project will research, develop and test a transformational customer service training suite of micro-qualifications aligned to industry stakeholder needs. Mayo Sligo Leitrim ETB have been successful in their bid to fund a project on training for the deployment of immersive technologies or IMTech. They've partnered with Limerick Clare ETB, with the Western Development Commission, Fast Track 2 IT, the Immersive Technology Skillnet, as well as the regional enterprise plan structures in the West and the Northwest to progress their project. This project will focus on the offshore renewable energy sector, taking a strategic approach to meet the anticipated growth in the upskilling and reskilling needs of the sustainable and green sector. The skills to advance innovation through collaboration fund projects will have benefits for all. Benefits for employees who will be able to access new, relevant and flexible learning opportunities across the further education and training sector. Benefits for employers who will use co-create, a use, who will rather co-create useful and agile solutions in partnership with FESH to overcome the upskilling and retention challenges they're facing. Benefits for education and training boards who will create new solutions and share their innovations across further education. And benefits for economic development collaborating with industry to solve real-world problems. This is how FET drives economic development. So congratulations once more to the lead ETBs, to Dublin Dunleary, to Kildare Wicklow and Mayo Sligo Leitrim on the award of this funding under the Skills to Advance Innovation through Collaboration Fund. Cohortigas, Gurmina Malmuth.